G'day guys, it's Ellie here from Nudge Marketing and I've got a really exciting update from ManyChat for you today. A lot of people have been asking how they can get their audiences from ManyChat into their Facebook audience so they can actually start creating lookalike audiences or they can start targeting people that have com um, conversed with them through Messenger. And what ManyChat have done is they have added a new feature which is to the pro account only. The first thing you need to do is you need to be in your ManyChat account and you need to be in the audience tag. I'm going to keep this really simple today and I'm actually just going to select everybody in my audience, which is just a case of clicking on the button up the top here. So I want to select everybody. Then I click over here on my bulk actions. And what I want to do is I want to export my PSID. Now PSID stands for Page Scoped ID. And this is basically the Facebook ID. So we click on export this and then it gives me the option to download the CSV file. Now a CSV file is the type of file that you need to upload into your asset library in your Facebook ads manager. So I'll download the file and that's now been downloaded. So what I do now is I go into my account inside my ads manager. And I need to be in audiences. And what I want to do is I want to create an audience. So I click on create audience. It's going to be a custom audience. It's a customer file that I'm going to be uploading. So I select customer file. I want to add customers from my own file because I've just downloaded the CS file from ManyChat. So I click on the top button here. I need to select the origin of my upload. Is it coming from customers and partners? directly from customers or from partners. This one is directly from customers because these people have already subscribed to ManyChat and to my account. So I select directly from customers. And then what I do is I just need to drop my folder into the file template here. The audience, I will rename this. So this is my ManyChat all subscribers and I'll put the date as well because this will be something I need to stay on top of click next okay and I need to edit the mapping so it's coming up and giving me a preview of my identifiers and on this side here, what I need to do is I go down and I choose the Facebook page user ID. OK, so we have our file that we have uploaded here. The um, mapping identifier is the Facebook page user ID. And now what we need to do is enter our Facebook page ID. Now, to get your Facebook page ID, what you need to do is you need to go into your business settings in your Facebook ads manager and the ID you will see underneath your business account here. So just click on copy to clipboard, go back into the audience, paste it in the area, hit enter and then add one page. And then it's going to allow me to upload and create which I will do. Okay, so it's telling me that most of the um, items have been uploaded, but there are a few that haven't been. So what I can do is actually have a look at the error report to find out what hasn't been uploaded. And that again is a CSV folder. And basically what it is, is I forgot to tick. So it was just the top row with the name of the row so I forgot to tick that I had the um, header in there. So then the great thing that you can do from here, which is where this gets really, really exciting, is you can go in and start creating lookalike audiences based on the people that are having conversations with you in Messenger. And if you've got a very active Messenger and your chatbot, this lookalike audience is going to be super, super strong. And from tests that have been run by other people that I know that have already started using this feature, they are seeing their ad costs halve and the number of people that are interacting with their ads double. So they're getting twice as many interactions for half the price, which is really a full time um, engagement. So as I say, really, really exciting. Just to recap for you, 
you need to go into your mini chat account. You need to go into your bulk actions here. And what you want to do is export this PSID. When you export this file, what you will notice is that it actually just exports all of the numbers. So it's not even exporting anything else. So Facebook are actually using this number. You can't get a better match than that. So if the Facebook, the Facebook ID and the mini and the PSID here, it's a hundred percent match. There can be no mistake. So hence the reason this is such a strong lookalike audience. So go knock yourself out, guys. Get in there. Get this PSID downloaded, uploaded into your um, audiences in your Facebook Ads Manager and start creating some custom accounts for that. Let me know how you go. And if you've got any questions, please leave them in the comments below. This is Ellie from Nudge Marketing with another chatbot tip. I'll see you again soon. Bye for now.